Okay, this is Tori and Goddess. What's going on? What y'all got going on today? How is everybody feeling, huh? Oh, me, I'm doing all right. <laughs> I'm doing okay. Just getting these messages out because I love y'all. Making sure y'all are sidestepping bullshit. You know, y'all destined path and ain't nobody doing y'all wrong. You know, I'm overprotective. I see somebody got a hater. Order in the court. Order in the court. Somebody might have some court issues too. One of my queens. Some temporary bullshit you done got yourself in. Some temporary hating ass shit, too. Michelle. Cat. Sandra. Sandra. Keisha. Last name start with a Y. One of y'all and O. You got some haters. Somebody trying to judge you. Trying to put all your business out in the streets. I heard you got some receipts on them too, though. Play your hair right. You won't have no court issues and fines for some disorderly conduct or assault. Or is that what happened? Let's take care not to have that happen. We ain't got no time to be um, catching no felonies. I don't care how low they are. That ain't the ticket. It take too long for you to expunge them, Queen. You hear me? Too long. Who is this hater? Who is this hater? Who is this hater, y'all? Yeah, my G said it's not worth your time, queen. Don't even go there. They said take some time out. It's somebody close to you. Somebody who you always with, who you jig with on a regular basis. My G says y'all like soldered together. <laughs> y'all bonded. Somebody in your family. Close family. What happened, y'all? What went on? They hating. They hating. They hating on you. Some throwback shit, my G said. Some throwback shit from your childhood, if I ain't mistaken. But you not even on it no more. I think you had just not even swept it under the rug. You you dealt with it. Y'all y'all hashed it out, but it's like they they still hating on you about something because you on top of your shit, my G said, too. And this Kimfo, they got a competitive nature going on. They on a shit brick road, y'all. They on a shit brick road and you not. <clears throat> Excuse me, y'all. Y'all kicked it in the same circles. What they call the ick and ack. Y'all was like peas and carrots. Yeah, y'all was like peas and carrots, but you grew up. You grew up. They they still doing, going about life as y'all did when y'all was partying and bar hopping and shit in your 20s. You like, no. Nah. I matured in my mind, most definitely my body. I ain't got time to be going out all night gallivanting. I got shit to do. I got shit to do. You go oriented. 
You got a vision, my G said. And recognize, analyze, and realize that rising above this situation, whatever is going on, is going to be for the best. I feel like the popo was called, the boys was called. That's how I'm feeling. I'm feeling like the popo was called. You got into it with somebody from your childhood? One of your neighbors, one of your close neighbors or some shit? Yeah, it's some bullshit coming. Because somebody, you you got a vision. You got a vision, all right. Somebody seeing through muddy waters, spotting goddamn dry land. And it's because it, it was a mirage at first with clear water. No, goddamn it. It's some shit in the game. Somebody then fucked up and fucked up, goddamn, then fucked up and had a one night stand. I got a Libra out here. I got a Libra out here. Incoming. Incoming, you got you got mail. That's a message coming. But my G said you kind of felt it coming too. Your intuition told you it was some shit in the game. My G said that's what they said. So what what's going on now? I don't think no police need to be called. I think you need to go about some shit a little differently. You understand me? That's a domestic violence. Mm-hmm, that's what I just heard. An intellectual combo is needed. Not what we spread and one another supporting each other's point of views and how they feel about this bullshit. Because, yeah, one night stand to me is some bullshit when you're in a committed relationship. Y'all know I'm going to keep it. Gotta, I'm gonna keep. I, I try my best to keep it real. You feel me? I do, and I I just don't agree with that. I don't. Um. They want to talk. I'm feeling like you, my dear Libra. Are their support. You're reliable. You're something like they back up. Is what I. Yeah. you something like they back up. You've been peering through these curtains for a minute though. Is what I'm hearing. Not like you on no peeping time shit. But on your Cagney and Lacey, your Pink Panther. Because this shit, you've been up in your feelings because you couldn't place your finger on what was going on. But some behaviors had changed. Swag changed, I heard. Swag changed as well. I'm talking to a Libra or Aquarius or somebody's involved with a Libra or Aquarius. Somebody want to talk to you. Somebody want to talk to you. Somebody want to discuss what great intentions they have you for you. Or they're thinking about some safety and success for you. Whoever this person is, my G said, they've been missing you. They've been missing you. Somebody, I'm feeling like... Somebody else from your childhood. Somebody else from your childhood. I feel like someone has been cheated on. Somebody has been cheated on. You thought that link on that chain was strong, my G said. That's what they said. But they said you got mail. And they want you to approach this shit like a grown ass man, like a grown ass woman. That's what they want you to do. Because I saw chains 
as like the police coming. Somebody fuck around and get blurred at the house, at the place of origin where this uh where you thinking about confronting somebody. Somebody ready to spring into action. Somebody's ready to spring into action. I feel like this one night like, stand happened in the spring and they didn't went back and forth for a minute as well. Mm. Like on a like it was springtime but it was still cold outside when they started messing around. Something felt kismet. What else, y'all? What is going on with this here? Something fat kids me. But they did did back and forth. They did did back and forth because they had ended it. But then they, they, they started back up again. Then they ended it. And now they don't even know what the fuck they want to do. Because they in the middle of some bullshit now. Because they didn't got caught up. They didn't got caught up. And it was bound to happen, this law coming down, because motherfuckers is sneaking and geeking behind somebody's back, cheating in the next room. Might as well have been, yeah, might as well have been, but, um... You... Need to know it's not worth your time to address it in the manner that you would like. It may bring some satisfaction to you because you're pissed. It said just go on and dip and don't look back. Remove yourself. That's easier said than done, I know. Um, before the summer is out. Before the summer is out is what I just heard. You need to dip set real quick, but... You about to have some text messages coming to you. You about to have some text messages coming to you. Maybe from a water sign. A cancer possibly. Adding some salt to the pot. They about to season the pot. The family issues will increase because they have something to add. They have something to add because I'm feeling like they knew something about it. So they're a little desperate and fearful. Yeah, they knew something about it. I feel like they're a little desperate and fearful. And your person might be a water sign as well, my Libra, my Aquarius. Your person could be a, a water sign as well. Somebody on vacation too, my G said. Somebody on vacation about to go on vacation. Don't let these haters fuck up your time off. My G said it was much needed. And whoever this whoever this person is you talking to or you with, I see E. The letter E. And up under it is temporary. Yeah, I'm most definitely talking to an air sign. They want me to know that because Jim and I just popped out. The police can get involved if you Go off hand cop, half cop, like hand cop. No, don't jeopardize yourself. I see a judge and I see a courtroom. I see court issues and fines. Ain't nobody got no money for that shit. Don't nobody got no money to be given to the to the courts. Yeah, I'm talking to someone who's on vacation. My G said you've been praying about a lot. You want to experience some increase. In your personal life, in your pockets. Most definitely, if you don't handle this situation even headed, even headed, um, I, I, I know it's going to be a little difficult because somebody didn't play their hand fucked up. But it's a blessing in disguise. 777. It's a blessing in disguise. You hear me? Um, 
You ask for most high's help. My G said, move out your own way because divine is assisting. This fell in your lap so you can be free, my G said. Be free from this contract is what they said. They said it was meant to. This this contract that you under with this person, it was meant. But the jig is up now. The G, That's what they said. The jig is up. Yeah, Pisces just flew out. The jig is up. Um, they said something did go on in the winter. That's that might be when it began, <clears throat> when like the end of March, beginning of April. It was still cold outside, is what they saying. But you, you had a sixth sense about it. My G said your antennas was up. They said you was wise to keep them up as well. You was wise to keep them up. A Taurus, a Taurus who the police, my G said, a Taurus who was the police, they said, pay attention to this Taurus, they said, pay attention to this Taurus, yeah, but it's Capricorn, well, whoever it is, because Libra just popped out again, so I'm speaking to a Gemini Aquarius or a Libra, they want you to pay attention to this earth sign. Capricorn, Taurus, pay attention to them. They said this person gonna most definitely be your backup and support you. They are reliable. They respect you and your situation is what I just heard. Reach out to them before you think about doing anything haphazard. That's what my G said because everything will fall. Everything will fall. You will start this autumn with some court fines and some court issues going back and forth to court, my G said, all because of a hater. Because this person is a hater. This person won't you change and bond it, my G said. Y'all might have a kid. Y'all might have a kid. Y'all might have some children. Your family values are up. My G says you're taking care of your business. you catering to your child's needs, and you've been catering to this person's needs. They said this person always competing against something. They they com they compete against you and they compete against against everybody else. They just got a competitive nature. They said they on they always on Flexbook and IG. Somebody social social media wanting somebody to pay attention to them. Said this person's self esteem is low. Said they rogue. This person is rogue in nature. My G said they are not true, my air sign. They fake. Said they phony and misery love company. Misery love company. That's why they around you, my G said. You something to do. You something to do, but they have betrayed you ten times over. Your mama suck dick for religion is what I heard. Is what I heard. So I'm talking to somebody old school. You remember that? Your mama suck dick for religion. Laugh it off. Laugh it off. Because my G said you not happy anyway. You not happy anyway. And they said you, turned, you told this earth sign that. You told this earth sign that you're not happy. You, 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 you not happy because you don't feel like you gaining anything. You don't feel like you have any gain. In your heart, in any relationship, or in your pockets. Or in your pockets. They want you to stay humble. They want you to stay humble. You a gentle, loving, kind person. He said you you can't let nobody dim your light, ma'am, sir. You can't you can't do you can't do that. And that's what this person wanna do. You thinking about, I feel like you're thinking about putting your hands on this person. Don't do that. Don't do that. Police will most definitely get involved. Police will most definitely get involved. Old ways don't open new doors. You didn't been there before. With an Aries. With a fire sign. My G says you a fucking dummy. You a for knock it head. You a motherfucking for knock it head. 
fucking with this goddamn water sign still is what they said. Who is this fire sign? It's Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. Because this person is on the side of you too. This person is on the side of you too. They said you got to start respecting yourself because it looked like you were in the middle of some bullshit. Whoever this Aries is, they a black up plan, plan too. Like this goddamn coronavirus, this COVID-19, this pandemic scandemic, you scamming yourself. You scamming yourself. You're going to hear something they said on social media real soon, very soon. That's going to make you evaluate yourself, going to make you evaluate your mate, this this water sign, this Scorpio, this Pisces, or this Cancer. And it's going to have you looking at you. And you're going to recognize, analyze, and realize that you it's lessons still needed to be learned. But this is something that you're going to have to do on a solo dolo mission, is what my G said. Because, yeah, it is a, a, a Leo or Aries, a fire sign who, who wants to connect with you. My G said change is good. You should try something new because this person is unlike the person that you're dealing with. This not this person is not like any person that you have been in a relationship with is what they just said. So you're gonna have to evaluate you. You're gonna have to grow up, my G said. You're gonna have to grow up. Mm -hmm, Cause this fire sign do want you. But you got a fucking entanglement and a predicament going on because your your feelings is elsewhere. My G said we always run away from the people who mean us some good and gotta go get our heads bumped. Head lock. Gotta go get our heads bumped and shit. Fucking with a tack head or a nigga brony who uh, really just wanna run circles around. Go in our pocket, have us in our feelings, and put them on a pedestal, and ain't nothing reciprocal. That's a one-way road. One-way street. One-way street. Mm-mm. 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 Psych, psych, your fucking motorbike, my G, sis. So what you gonna do? You need not put your hands on nobody. Male or female. Don't do that. Don't do that. I said a DV is imminent. A DV is imminent. It's about to be goddamn Friday. You you will not get out until Monday. You will not get out until Monday. What else, y'all? Mm-mm, that's too much. Yeah, you won't get out until Monday. So think long and hard about your approach to danger. Because it's, it's dangerous what's going on. Cheating. Possibly with a neighbor. That's what I heard. That might be for somebody else. Cheating, though. No. Somebody cheating at work. Somebody cheating at work, too. Somebody may... Do some EVS or some um, janitorial work. They got a job where they got to pay attention to details. My G said, follow the guidelines and don't rush. Don't rush. But ain't no money in bed. You cheating. You cheating with your coworker. Somebody cheating with their coworker. And ain't no motherfucking money in bed, my G said. Somebody taking inventory of that already. Somebody taking inventory. Goals about to be met. Somebody is really passionate about their job and their home life. Y'all got your own. You got your own. It's your key. It's your doorknob. Everything off in that motherfucker yours, my G said. You got your own comfy living going on and you passionate about making ends meet with somebody who is matching your vibe, with somebody who was on your level. And you passionate about your work too. 
You really never work in my G, Sid, because you like what you do. You love what you do. Think about this money. You got to make this money happen, my G, Sid. Although money ain't everything, but you comfy, right? You go to you go to jail, you going to miss you going to miss some hours, ain't you? Not only that, you're going to be giving up your freedom. Then you fuck around and lose your job because you're going to be having to take time off to go to motherfucking court. Don't be no goddamn finocket head. Don't be no goddamn finocket head. Ain't no indecision here. If you indecisive, stop that shit. You the boss. You the head. You the head nigga in charge. You the head bitch in charge. You don't like how I said it. I'm saying it with all due respect. But you listen to what I'm saying. Don't you go going off on a tangent and and wanting to put your hands on nobody because of this information that's falling in your lap. Approach this danger calmly because it's dangerous territory. I understand how you're feeling. And if if you need to call, they said you if you need to call that earth sign, you better do that shit. That's what they said. I want you to take care of your anger. It's going to be hard for you to do that because this shit is going to irritate your every existence. You're going to want to fight because there's haters in your camp. My G said, remove the hater. Remove the hater. Evaluate what's happened so you can get the lesson. Don't pull the band-aid off too quick. You feel me? No, you got to, it, 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 it was because some shit stink. Some shit stinks, so you got to pull it off a little bit, let it get some air. That's your emotions. Your emotions. I don't even know if that was a good analogy. You hear me? Um, But take care of your, your mental. Take care of your emotions. Shit happens to everybody, as I see. I mean, you know, ain't nobody faithful around this motherfucker. And you think about what you putting out into the universe. Are you faithful? Are you a faithful mate? But somebody refer you to date someone because you a good man, you a good woman, and you not going to dip out on them? Yeah, think about that too. In the meantime, sit your ass down and have several seats. Don't put your hands on nobody. You hear me? Torian Goddess loves you. Stay strong. Stay powerful. See you.